Hi, um, this is Kirsty Valentine. Happy Sunday to everybody. Thank you very much for tuning on to my channel today. Uh, thumbs up for like. Always remember to share this video with your family and friends, your neighbors, your colleagues, your boyfriend, your lover, your husband, your wife, your fiancé, and everybody that you know. Today, this story um, hit me, hit me like a brick. This story hits, hits me like a tornado. This story hits me, my heart, it pierced through my heart. I am so, I'm so hot. I'm really, really hot. It's so demeaning. It's so, it's so, it's, I, in fact, if I have any word, any other word was, was done or better than the word I have just used, I will use it. Forgive me, I'm not the, I'm not a, the dictionary. Um, it's about how one of our African brothers was uh, wrapped and put on a plane to be de deported from France by the Turkish immigration authorities. Basically, he was wrapped with uh, cellophane paper, like a parcel, bundled, and put in an Air France uh, uh, flight to go back to Africa. He was being deported. Hold on a minute. Let me get a cellophane wrap and you will see what I mean. This is clean, uh, this is, okay, this is clean film. I don't know if you can see it, but this is clean film because, you know, when it comes under the camera, it turns upside down. So, this is what they used to wrap in, clean film. You know, this is for, this is for domestics. This is for cooking. This is for wrapping food. This is for, yeah, this is how they wrapped this this is what they use to wrap our african brother wrap him wrap him round can you imagine wrapping somebody say this is a human being you wrap 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 and send him to africa with a clean thing that is how they sent him to africa i'm going to put a short pic um, uh, uh, pictures uh, some uh, photo images and then we'll continue with our conversation. Thank you. I want to wear my clothes. You got it. Oh, hey. Hey. Give me my clothes. I want to wear my clothes. My clothes. I want to wear my clothes. You got it. Ah. I want to wear my clothes. In what world are we living right now? I want to wear my clothes. They cannot do this to a white man. They can man. never yeah. do this to a white man. I want to wear my clothes. Oh, you see black people. You see animals. Merde. The mission. You see black people. The mission. If you can't do this, you can't do this. What is this? 
So we are back. In in after the photo images I put in there, I also put in the video so you can see how they wrapped him like even worse than an animal. You wouldn't even wrap an animal like that because it's, it's, uh, it hurt me, it, um, it, it, it hurts me that in this modern age, in, in this modern age that we are, age of technology, that black people are still treated inhumane, worse than a cattle or an, uh, an animal, as a, so dehumanized as a human being, simply because of the part of the world they come from and the color of their skin. It is it is horrible in the whole of Africa. Once you are a foreigner, we give you privileges. It's not because that we feel that you are superior to us or we are inferior to you. It's just that it is imbibed in us and in our culture that you should always make a foreigner feel at home and feel welcome. But when we Africans travel abroad, the reverse is the case. It is so disappointing. It is it's dehumanizing. You know, let me read what one of um, our fellow uh, brothers said. He said, every African needs to watch this to see how Europeans treat Africans in their country. That is after the video. He said, this African man has been wrapped in plastic clean films. Let me bring out the clean film. That is it. That is the clean film. In this clean film, you know, and put on a plane to be deported from France. What nasty deported from France by Turkish, I think they said Turkish authority because I'm hearing different stories here. Some people are saying Turkish, some people are saying uh, uh, France. But he was deported and he was in an airplane, uh, is it airplane or uh, one of those. But what they are mentioning here is to be deported from France. What nasty and inhuman behavior of these French authorities to dehumanize a fellow human being like this. Such vile, contemptible, deplicable, and disgusting act of the French government. But for the strong protest and intervention of fellow Africans on board the flight to ask the clean film, that is the that is a clean, how can you how can you wrap a, a human being with this? This is for food. This is what you use to wrap for food. You put it in freezer, you put it in the fridge. To ask the clean films. But for the protest and intervention of fellow Africans to board the flight, or uh, uh, Africans on, 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 on board the flight. So Africans in the flight, fellow Africans were the ones who protested. Who protested? If you, I will put the video after my commentary. So you go through the video again and see. And please share this video with your friends. To so ask the clean thing removed, the man could have been deported disgracefully and dehumanized just like that. Even animals do not get treated like this. If an animal is mishandled or treated like this, most of the animal charities and animal rights advocates would have headed straight to the streets and demonstrated and the courts will be asking for judgment against the government and those authorities involved. Why is the United Nations, UN and other human rights activists not doing the same to register their protests and condemn the disgusting, filthy, wicked and evil acts of the French government or immigration authorities? I'm asking the same question too. So the Europeans treat and appreciate and respect their dogs and their cats more than a fellow black, a human being like them, who happens to have a different skin color because he's a black man and he's from Africa. Why are we human beings so wicked? Why are we human beings so wicked? How can you wrap somebody with this? How, how can? Let me read what this is meant for. I will read it from the pack. It says, suitable for general food use, fridges, freezers, and microwaves. It didn't say wrap a human being and put it in the flight or put it in the microwave or freezer or fridge. 
It says seals in food flavors. It seals in food flavors and helps to protect food uh, uh, to keep food fresh. Helps to prevent food odor and, and, and stains. Let me read that again. Suitable for general food use, fridges, freezers, and microwaves. Seals in food flavors and helps to keep food fresh. Helps to prevent food odor and taints. It did not say, it did not say that you should wrap a human being, a whole human being, a man, wrap a human being in that and burn them because you want to, you want to deport them. You could have asked, the French authorities could have asked for immigration officers to escort him and make sure he gets into the plane and put him on the seat and put an immigration officer with him or get the country of abroad where he comes from in Africa, get an official from the embassy in your country to follow him back to, to, to France, uh, to his country and not, and not wrap a human being with this. If I, if I read it again, it says, important safe guidelines. When cooking in microwave, do not wrap food directly in the film. Even when you are cooking in the microwave, you cannot wrap the food directly in the film and put it in the microwave. So Europeans have, have respect for the clean film and the food they are going to put in the microwave than the human being that they have wrapped with this. I'm using this opportunity to seize, I'm seizing this opportunity to call for protest from human rights, Amnesty International and the uh, United Nations. We are not a third world country. The people say first world, third. we are not third world country. There is only one world that we all live in. The wealth of the world today is all coming from Africa. There is no continent that will survive and stand still like Africa as we have done. We feed the world. People say Africans are poor. Why are we poor? Because you are sucking out all the wealth from Africa. So you can't even, you, you are sucking all the wealth and making your country better. But you cannot treat the people who come from that same continent better. You treat your own dogs and cats better than a fellow human being. This is ridiculous. Let me read another comment from another, another person. He says, this is ridiculous. In the 21st century, black are still treated like non-humans. Where did we go wrong? What have we learned so far from this kind of humiliation? The black man must wake up. You wrap someone in a plastic bag like he is meat or something only because he's been deported. They will definitely not do this to a white man or another race. It's just crazy. Yes, it is. That the way we are being humiliated and de de dehumanized in the presence of other race. I can't even count how many times I've been so dehumanized. I posted a video. I post, may I talk this one for my language? I post video of how uh, a, a person, they treat me for where they work. How she tell they treat me. Thank God, say God, don't carry me come off for there. And I mean, they do work past. I know they talk. If I get a problem, I know they complain. I go put a girl, or you get put, I go do one. Not only say they will, they, they, they will disrespect you, they will, they, will, they, will, they will dehumanize you in presence of other race. So other race will join them and start disrespecting the white black, black man. What has the black man done? We haven't done anything wrong. What, no, what, what did we do? You come to Africa, we treat you nice, we respect you, not because we feel that you are superior and we are inferior, because you are a visitor and we welcome you. But you, we go to other countries and they treat us so bad. Look at all the French people and all the Turkish people living in Africa. Ask them, do we, do we treat them the way they treat us? If you want, to do, uh, you want to deport somebody out of your country, fair enough, you have the right to say somebody should not live in your country. But you don't wrap somebody up with this. You don't wrap a human being with this. This is ridiculous. How can you wrap a human being with this one? Huh? It's so, it's so ridiculous. How, why would you wrap a human being with this? It's not food, not a container, not that you are wrapping vegetables. You can read this. Let me read it again. It says, suitable for food wrap in the fridge, freezers, and microwave. Seals in food flavors and helps to keep food fresh. Helps to prevent food odor and taints. It didn't say human being. People should protest again. Where are the human rights? Human rights activists, the activists or organization. Where is Amnesty International? If you were to be animals and dogs, you see them protesting. 
Look at the way they protested against killing of foxes. Now you see foxes fighting with you with your food in the streets, all over in the streets today. If you go out, you are rushing back home. You don't want attack from fox at night. You go to the park in the daylight, you see fox everywhere. Eh? Animals are fighting with you in your own house because of a human rights activist. Uh, sorry, not human rights activist, animal rights. So where are the human rights activists? So my people, please help me to share. Help me to share this video. This is so humiliating. I think we should do a hashtag and protest, protest against this. And the Africans, Africans in, in France and these countries that this man was deported from, and from the country in Africa that he was deported from, they should protest and go on the street and get lawyers, human rights lawyers, and they should go to world courts. This is ridiculous. So, fellow guys, share this video. Share this video. This is your favorite baby, your favorite TT, Kesty Valentine. And, 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 you know, comment and share, you know, uh, this video. This is human. It's, it's high time that, you know, uh, the black man and the black race is treated. We feed the world. All the minerals and resources, the diamond, the gold, the precious stone, it's all coming from Africa. Yet, the people who, till, who you steal all these uh, minerals and resources from in their continent, the people that come from this continent, you don't have appreciation, you don't have respect for them. You will demean them, you put them in the spot, and you will demean and dehumanize them and disrespect them in the presence of other race. And then other race is beginning to think, oh, that's the way the black man needs to be treated. We too will start treating them. And that is why other race are joining to mistreat and to disrespect the black race. What did we ever do? What wrong did we do? We were sitting in our planet, we didn't ask you people to come when you people came. So enough is enough. Please share this video. Thank you very much. You Mais ça, c'est pas normal. Je vais te donner ma clause. Regardez. Hey! Mes clothes, je vais te donner ma clothes. Ma clothes, je vais te donner ma clothes. Je vais te donner ma clothes. Je vais te donner ma clothes.